Hello, hello, hello. Hello to all my friends and family. Back to you again. My friend, I'm so sorry. You don't hear from me the other day. My phone giving me so much trouble, so much problem. So I could not take it. So yesterday I go to the T-Mobile store and take a phone. Put it on my payment plan. You know, the phone is very expensive. Very expensive. Six and seven hundred dollars and, and, and up if you want a good phone. So I put it on my payment plan. And my bill. So, you know, could pay it little by little. My friend, so I'm so sorry you don't hear from me from the other day. So guys and girl, thank you for having patient with me. Thank you to wait on me. Yeah, wait on me. Okay, now my friend, I have something very, very important to tell my friends and family, but as I said, all my business are very, very important. Because I know you're going to... Yeah, you're going to say, our business is always important. Yeah, yeah. My business, my business, always important. Yeah, very much important business. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. So, my friend... Listen what I'm going to have to tell all my friends now. My friend, when I just get here from Jamaica, if anyone didn't know, I'm a Jamaican. Yeah. So when I just get here from Jamaica, things was very, very, very hard for me and my husband. It was hard because, you know, we leave everything back home and come here to start a different life. It was so rough. I cried, I cried, I cried, I cried, I cried. And my friend, when I cried so much, and I go to my bed, I cry myself to sleep. I cry so much on my husband's shoulder. I don't even know when I go to sleep. But anyway, when I go to sleep, my, I didn't know that my ancestors, they was watching me and they was see how I was crying. And they said, but this, she, she didn't, she don't deserve that. This young lady don't deserve it at all. So they didn't like how I was crying. So then this lady come to me and said to me, all your want is 300. 300 take the 300 and go home mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. take the 300 and go home you know we're home back to jamaica take the 300 all you want is 300 take it and go home my god my god but I am the person with I doesn't like to um, buy numbers. I don't like the gamble thing. So I don't really buy numbers. So when I wake up in the morning, I said to my husband, because me and my husband, we doesn't live the same place. Because we just get here. So I live with my family and he live with his family. But that one night we spent together. So I wake up in the morning and I said to him, Dave, Dave, Buy 300. So I tell him that somebody come to me in my sleep. My ancestors, as I, as I know, come to me in my sleep and said, all your need is 300. Take it and go home. So I tell my husband, then I wake up in the morning, you know, take care of myself and go back to where I stay with my family. He go back to where he stay with his family. Yeah, uh huh. So when I go back home, I wait around the television. 
when the evening coming up. And I know this Spanish lady gonna say, Oh, Landa de no! When you know when she's calling the number. So I sit around the television, man. Wait to hear this lady call the numbers. Cause I love like how she calls it because she calls it so sweet. And when I hear this lady said three, I said, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. When I hear she said zero, I said, uh-huh, uh-huh. That one I should say zero. I said, oh! mm -hmm. So I grabbed my phone. I called Dave. That's my husband. So whenever time I call him, I said, Dave, 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 Dave. You kill it. You kill it. You mash it up. Oh, my God. Dave said, mash up what? I said, oh, Dave. You did the body number? I said, oh, shit. Yeah, that's what, she, that's what he said. Oh, shit. Cher, sorry. I didn't remember Cher. I couldn't say nothing. Because both me and him are so stressed out. We are so stressed out. But because I know he's a number person... I didn't call him to say Dave remember the number because I know he liked to buy those things. God, that's the only thing he liked to do. He doesn't drink. He doesn't smoke. He doesn't do nothing. All he do is just buy his number. So I know I don't have to remind him because I know he's a person who never forgot numbers. But that time he forgot it. And I didn't call him to remind him. I didn't call him to remind him. When I see the number comes out, I felt so, 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 so bad. I feel like I want to cry when I see the number comes out. Three, zero, zero. Oh, oh, oh. I want to cry. I want to cry. But you know what? I said, Lord, I have to take up the pieces and go on. So then, the next night I go to my bed. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. I'm telling you, this lady come back to me. Mm -mm 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 -mm. It better she didn't come back. She cursed me. She cursed me. She put her finger like this in my face. You fool. You fool. That's how she pants in my face. You fool. You fool. You damn fool. I couldn't say nothing. Hear why she said I'm a damn fool. Because she didn't give my husband the 300 number. She gave it to me. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. She didn't give it to my husband. She gave it to me. So she expect me to go and buy the number. After she see all the problem I'm going through. She give me the number. So I could win. And go back home. Because at the time. I just bought my house. And I can't afford. To cannot pay the mortgage. And then the bank take back my house. That was the last money I have in my bank. The last money I have. And a bar of money. Put on it. To buy my little house in Jamaica. So I could not afford. I could not afford for the bank to take back my house. Because if, if, if I lose my house. Then I lose everything. So when this lady come back to me and cursing me. Cursing me. You damn fool. You da I couldn't say nothing. When I wake up. I wake up crying in my sleep. Yeah. Yeah, I wake up crying in my sleep. Mm -hmm. Because I never seen nothing so plain. I never seen nothing so plain. She come to me and she curse me bad. Bad, bad, bad. You dumb fool! You dumb fool! Because why? She gave me a number to take me out of poverty. And I didn't use the number the way she gave it to me. 
And from that time, this lady, this special lady, because I have more than one people talk to me, but this one special, from that time until now, she never come back to me. Yeah, never come back to me. She was so mad. She was so mad. She was so mad. Because she see what I'm going through with my family. She see the stress and everything. And she want me to get some money and go home. Leave your family. Even if you don't want to go home. But at least I could have some money to get an apartment. Even if I didn't want to go home then. Because I just come to America. So I want to look like the American dream. So maybe I wouldn't go home at the time. But at least I could pay off of my house. I could pay my house off. And at least I could even maybe rent something here. Or even can buy something here too. You never know how much would I get. So I could even buy something here too. And pay for what I have back home. You never know. But I didn't listen to this lady. And oh boy. My ancestor. She cursed me so bad. She cursed me so bad. When I wake up, I felt so bad. I sweat. I sweat. I wet. The way she cursed me. I crying. Crying, crying. Anybody ever dream? And when you wake up, you find yourself crying? That's me. That's me. She cursed me so bad. I was crying, crying so bad. Yeah. Even when I wake up, I was still crying. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I felt so bad to see all the things I'm going through. And I did not buy this number. Did not buy this number. So all I can say to all my friends, if your own sister talking to you, please listen. Please listen, hear them out. Because sometimes they're giving you the right thing to make your life better. But we don't follow our dream. We don't listen. If I was listening to my ancestors a long time ago, my life would be better off long, long, long time ago. But every time that they talk to me, I just box it off. Poof. Poofs. Poofs. Yeah. Every time they talk to me, I just box it off. Box it. You, know, you know, you're young. You're young, so you don't really take these things, you know. But it hurt. It hurt. Really hurt. She really cursed me so bad. So bad she cursed me. So bad I couldn't take it. I have to cry. Yeah. So to all my friends and family... Whenever time your ancestors come to you in your dream and telling you something, please listen. Yeah, please listen. Now, if I'm going someplace now, and they come to me and say to me, Sharon, don't walk that road. Don't drive that road. Don't go right there. Now I'm listening. Because I know why I listen now. Because everything... That they tell me it's it's happened. It happened. So now I listen now because I see how my life could better off long, 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 long time ago. But I blow it. Yeah. I blow it. Yeah, I blow it. God bless you, my friend. Love you all. And sorry for all this long time you didn't hear from me. Love you all. God bless. Pray for me while I'm praying for all my friends. Yeah. And family. God bless you all. Love you. Mwah. My friend. Mm. No, no, no. My friend in Connecticut. Ah. Uh, I love everything you do, man. I love everything you do, God. It's beautiful. I love it. I love it. I love it. And to all my friends and my fellow cop in the UK, love you, love you, love you. And to all my friends, don't feel bad. You know why I'm healing this person? 
because this person give me a special hail. So I'm giving them a special hail back. But I love all my friends. God bless you. Love you. Looking forward to work with you guys. And friends and family. Love you all. God bless. Peace. I may the grace of God be with you all. Love you. God bless.